swag on a million trillion. Self-esteem through the roof. Nigga, who you think you is? You think you look good? Bitch, I look good. Bitch, I look good. Bitch, I look good. Bitch, I look good. Swaggy, bitch, I look good. From the hood to the hood, from the hair to the head, to the jeans, to the jeans, to the shirt, from the shirt, to the butt, to the butt, to the jeans, from the jeans, to the chain. I just had to let that get out there before I start the video or whatever. Um, I don't really know who that's by. I think that's by P. Nice, the VA General, a.k.a. Mr. Bitch, I Look Good. That's who that's by. Anyways, um, I hate this... Uh, I hate that I gotta be so specific, but um, with who I'm talking to, but um, one of the main people who made me want to make this video is Powder Pink. Um, I hate name dropping. Anyways, I don't know her or nothing. We ain't cool or nothing like that. But I digress. <laughs> Chill on the six. Anyways, um, she feeling bad about herself because she's fat now. And she's been making like a flurry of videos, not a flurry of videos, let me take that back. But she's made more than one video about her being fat. I guess maybe she, I've been subscribing her for a minute, not a whole long time, but uh, it looks like she might have gained maybe 20 or 30 pounds or something like that. But uh, in the interim, she feels like she's fat. So, um... She's been making videos, you know, fucking fat. Uh, she's she's really she really feels, you know, bad about being fat. And her latest video um, was ways to tell that you're fat, or let me let me let me let me look right quick. I'm not, it's not gonna take me forever. To look, I'm just saying. I want to be specific with um, what I'm talking about, but uh, I'll, go, I'll get back to that. You know you are fat when, and uh, it's basically, it started off um, being really funny, you know, or funny to whoever the fuck thinks it's funny to, um, you know, to... Pick at fat people, make people feel um, bad about, you know, their weight or whatever. But I don't know Powder Pink personally. Um, I, I, there's a couple of videos that she made I thought were cool. That's why I subscribe. I'm a subscriber junkie. I mean, I, I subscribe. If I like one of your videos, I subscribe. But um, I try not to do that as much. The more I got into YouTube, I didn't do it. But she would kind of, the way that she is coming about off of her gaining weight makes me feel like she's one of these uh i call them my hometown people i call them um that the assholes um and if you're one of my church friends and you're watching this video i apologize but um whatever these people who always pick at me for being fat who always says something about she's so fat you know she do this that and another Throughout the course of, say, the last 10, maybe 12 years, they themselves have gotten fat. Always is the people who have so much to say, they end up getting fat. And when they get fat, then it's, you know, it's supposed to be okay. It's supposed to be what's hot to be fat or whatever. But I've always been fat. And one of her things, a couple of her things, a couple of of what pretending to people thinking you're fat, thinking you're pregnant, or assuming that you're pregnant, and um, you know, I've always been fat. So if somebody asks me if I'm pregnant, I'm basically like, bitch, I've always been big. I, I ain't big. I said I ain't pregnant, not big, cause I am big. I'm fat. I don't call myself thick or chunky. I'm fat, and I'm proud to be what I am, because the body that I'm in right now is what I'm gonna be in until I finish changing it. But I'm not going to hate myself because somebody else assumes that their opinion should affect how I feel about myself. But when people ask me if I'm pregnant, they assume that I'm pregnant. 
I'll either say, because uh, sometimes it's, you know, um, church people or something, I'll say, no, I'm not pregnant. I've been fat since you met me. Okay, so you know I'm not pregnant. I don't have no kids. Or I'll say something uh, like, um, baby, when I get pregnant, I'll make sure you're the first to know since you're so interested in it. But my general go-to for stupid people like that, because if you think somebody might be fat, and you ask them about being pregnant, why don't you just wait nine months and, and see if a baby show up? I mean, that's just easier than just assuming that you have the right to try to, you know, to ask them something that might offend them. But usually I say, no, baby, I'm just full of sexy juice. That's what I'm full of. I'm full of sexy juice all day, a day. That's what I'm full of. Uh, as far as you can only wear Janet Jackson clothes, which was when Jan Jackson was heavy, she said all she could wear was scrubs and uh, uh, jogging pants. I don't own a set of scrubs. I don't own any jogging pants. I don't walk around in sandals all day long. I don't, um, you know, I don't walk around barefooted. I am fly. If you're having a problem being a fat person, um, dealing with your clothes, you have to excuse that, uh-uh new house. I suggest you get with someone who has, um, you know, embrace the fact that just because you're big, you don't have to dress a certain way or be a certain way. I refuse to hate myself to the point that I'm down on myself harder than other people can be. It's just not worth it. It's not, it's not worth it feeling so bad because you heavy. Because if it floods, you can float. And if there's a famine, you be all right. I don't appreciate people who assume that being fat means you're miserable. Means that you should be miserable. You shouldn't wear gold belts. You shouldn't wear high heels. You shouldn't wear tight pants. You shouldn't. Why shouldn't I? Why shouldn't I wear something I want to wear because I feel like it looks good on me? Why shouldn't I feel good about myself? Why do I have to feel bad about myself? I'll listen to your answer. Don't worry. I'll wait. Oh, all fat, or being fat, you be unhealthy. Are you unhealthy? Hmm. So you know how many fat people to know that they're all unhealthy? I would take that the fat people that you know who are unhealthy would be you're over 40, been obese most of their life, don't eat right kind of fat people. Being fat doesn't mean that you're automatically unhealthy. It doesn't mean that you're dirty. It doesn't mean that you can't, that you can't find anyone to date. It doesn't mean that you are any less beautiful or sexy than the next person. You have someone who loves you, and you have plenty of subscribers who love you, and they look up to you, and to a certain extent, they, they come to your page because you're just a great person and they love your energy. And what is most important about you is not how your body is, because if it's hinged on that, it's hinged on something that changes every single day. If you feel fat or oh well, you're going to change it. But if you don't, in case you don't, you need to be happy with you. I'm not a fat bitch. I'm fat. At times, I'm bitchy. But I refuse, okay, to just be one of the fat girls who is just agreeing with you or coming to whatever kind of party you have. And it ain't a pity party. But it's a, it's a bashing party because you got to get used to how you are. But um, I guess I took too long making this video. I'm going to make another one because it's been bothering me. I've been sitting by and watching. I have school and I have um, my home to take care of. And I haven't been able to do what I wanted to do. So I guess um, this is the part two.